do you have one of them lessons where you feel that nothing's going to plan and you think, God, this is going worse. I feel like giving up. If you do, stay tuned. So just so you know, it happens to everyone. You'll, you'll finish a lesson and it'll be probably the worst lesson you've ever had and you'll feel like things are going backwards. And um, what you gotta remember is don't give up, no matter how um, hard it feels at that point, don't give up, talk to people, get off your chest, uh, watch these videos if they're helping you and um, get back in for your next lesson. Already thinking about the mistakes that's gone wrong to try and get yourself in that right frame of mind to get over that hurdle. Um, lots of people will um, finish a lesson and feel like they've had the worst lesson with clutch control or they've had the worst lesson on roundabouts, um, but they don't give up because they get back in there the following week and they're determined to crack it and determined to pass that test. And that's what you've got to say to yourself. If you're one of people at the moment where you're feeling down and you're feeling like, like you feel like you've, you've wasted 10 hours or 20 hours or 30 hours or more, then don't feel like that. Just remember that everyone goes through the stage where they, where they struggle and you just got to pick yourself up, dust yourself down and look at the mistakes, speak to your instructor, work on the mistakes. Don't just go on to the next lesson, get on the next thing, take a step back and work on their mistakes because if you're struggling with clutch you've got to deal with your clutch if you're struggling with roundabouts then deal with roundabouts whatever that area will be it could be a maneuver that you just can't there's always one maneuver that a learner can't grasp the, you know there's four maneuvers that you need to learn for the uk driving test and there's always one that people struggle with um and that's the one you've got to work on more but remember you're not on your own and when you get over that hurdle and you're feeling, feeling good about it, all of a sudden, yeah, it'll start to accelerate you. You're learning again and you're gonna catch up with where you was. So remember, don't give up. And the other thing also to think about, and this is something that don't catch people out, is when you've passed that point and you're thinking, right, I've got my driving test coming up now. I've got over that hurdle. I've, I'm, everything's going fine. I'm not stalling. My, my, my gears are fine. I'm not pulling off on the wrong gear. That's a mistake people do. Um, you've got your test coming up. And a week or two for your test, it seems to go backwards again for you. And you've just got to say to yourself, these things happen. I know I can drive. I've been driving consistently for the last five weeks, really good. And my instructor's been telling me I'm doing really good. And my mum and my dad who sits with me, they've been telling me I'm doing really good. And it's probably a bit of nerves causing it. So same thing again. If you've had a bad lesson, pick yourself up, dust yourself down and um, work on the mistakes and don't give up okay good luck and uh, if you like the videos click on like and if you like this channel subscribe take care safe driving and look out for my next video next week